I literally look like a baby raccoon. I look like a raccoon, guys. I look like a... Oh my God. <laughs> everyone welcome back to my channel welcome welcome back happy new year to everyone <laughs> fireworks <laughs> i hope you're all eating the 12 white grapes under the table because lord knows i was yeah yeah you know i was welcome back to my channel my name is karina or karina Ter, and here we do lifestyle travel and crochet content and i guess today must be lifestyle content because I don't have a skincare routine guys uh, I just want to start off I don't have a skincare routine because I don't have a routine in anything in anything in this life I'm really trying I'm really trying if you saw my year compass on my vision slash reality board planning you know one of my goals for the year is to, to develop routines my skincare routine right now is washing my face with African black soap and then moisturizing my skin either with aloe vera and vegetable glycerin mixed together or using my spray of rose water normal water vegetable glycerin and aloe vera that's what i use it's not, not doing anything the vegetable glycerin as you can see my skin is very smooth it's lost a lot of its texture because all that texture i don't want it personally i don't know who downloaded that pack for my sim but i don't want it I, oh ignore this guys i burnt my eyebrows using nair <laughs> i was too cheap I'm not being cheap this year anymore guys as you can see I have a lot of hyperpigmentation you might not have been able to see up close but if I stand away you can see there's like light here dark here and there's more darkness here as well oh this camera isn't doing it justice some people might be like babe we can see it some people be like babe there's nothing there there's hyperpigmentation I'm telling you there is so of course I had to go to my Google which is YouTube and chat GPT and I was like can you please devise a skincare routine for me? I need to get a cleanser, I need to get a toner, I need to get an exfoliator, I need to use sunscreen, I need to... Ugh. As a girl, <laughs> this is so intense, this is so much information. I never really invested in my makeup, I never really invested in my skincare. I didn't really invest in myself until 2023. So we're gonna take it to the next level this year. I need to learn all these things. Like there's so much about women's health and like, femininity and skincare and that I just don't know and YouTube University and TikTok University is having to teach me you know I wasn't taught it so I need to learn it all I need to learn everything now by myself so I know some people on TikTok were talking about the kojic acid soap people were like there's no point using the kojic acid soap if you're not going to use sunscreen I was like well I guess I'm going to use sunscreen then mm. <laughs> I was like mm gonna use sunscreen then mm. i'm actually they're hurting me they're literally supporting me and they're trying to get my skin better okay so i'm back on chat gpt on my laptop so you guys can actually see what i'm doing i need to get a gentle cleanser so my cleanser i'm in the corner sorry guys my cleanser i think i want it to be my african black soap because i know that works for me i don't want to start doing things that i don't want to do everything brand new if i know my african black soap works for me i'm going to keep using it but obviously i wash my face twice a day so I'm thinking I might use kojic acid in one of those washes. Well, that, is that too much? Guys, please, I haven't got a sister and my mommy doesn't help me. Exfoliates are quite harsh. They're kind of rough. They're kind of rough. They're kind of mean to my skin. What is an exfoliant? Let's ask Chetty. Ooh. Ooh. She ate. She ate. Okay, so now I'm hearing words I know, like words I've heard of before. Exfoliant should be something like salicylic acid or glycolic acid. I think I'm going to use salicylic acid because I'm a sleepy, smiley girl. I like the letter S. I'm going to use salicylic acid. Okay, you know there's certain brands that you just know are skincare brands? I know the Ordinary is one that everyone uses. You holds the pretty skin. I know everyone uses the ordinary, so I'm gonna immediately look there for the salicylic acid, and it's four pound fifty nine. So, thank you, <laughs> guys. I'm about to eat everyone up. Like my skin's gonna go crazy in a good way. Please God, thank you. My skin's about to go crazy. If you guys ever want to see my skincare routine, once I have it established, I will do a video on that because I want to do that. I want to do that. Yeah, but I'm gonna keep shopping. <laughs> I was back on TikTok and I just realized 
I need a nighttime routine as well. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, I'm starting to get confused and a little bit overwhelmed with all the products. 2023 me will just give up, but I won't be doing that. I've decided I'm gonna get the Kojic Acid Soap from Amazon. Look how dark my eyes are! The Kojic Acid Soap from Amazon. Then I'm gonna go to Holland and Barrett and Superdrug to find Vitamin C Serum and Salicylic Acid because I'm getting confused, I'm getting overwhelmed, I'm getting stressed. And I don't like to be stressed. This is like Shein because everything I want is in Neutrogena but I don't use Neutrogena because they test on animals. So I don't know. I don't know what to do. I ain't doing that to the animals. I can't do that. But it's like everything that I need is from Neutrogena. But I'm going to use the... Ooh. I'm going to get the salicylic acid and sicker booster. I already have this at uni but I don't have it at home and I can still take it to uni. And then... 10% vitamin C booster. I don't know if that's gonna work, but hopefully it does. And then two lip balms. I'm so excited. I always come into Holland and Barrett just to see what deals they have, but there's nothing here that I want. All these little lip balms, I just bought some from Holland from Superdrug, but they have some really cute ones, really cute packaging, and they're all like eco friendly. I usually use these shampoo and conditioner bars, but I've just bought conditioner from the other place, so I don't need it. If you can, try a conditioner bar. They're kind of expensive, though, I'm not going to lie, but they're better for your hair, better for the planet. Do it if you can. This Sukin, Sukin? Hydrating Mist Toner. I'm just getting things now, but this is going to be the last thing, because if not, I'll just be buying to buy. Should we see confectionery? Let's see what cute snacks we can get. And I need to go to the gym and I'll do a haul when I get home. I'm back home in my house with my little brother and I'm gonna do a haul of everything I got and then my little brother can react. As we know, I'm on my little skincare journey so I'm gonna show you everything I got. I got argan oil conditioner. Guess how much it was? No, you guess. Guess how much Guess how much, one more time. I got four. Okay, it's a moisturizing argan oil conditioner. I've got four, because I saw it at the till. You guys didn't see this in the footage. One was one pound. Because they're changing the packaging. You could have one. Guess how much this massive tofu was. T, guess how much this was. Guess again. Guess again. 24 pence. Then I got these lip balms. These are the only lip balms I use other than my lip glosses from this small business. But I'll show you guys the small business. But yeah. I got this hydrating mist toner because I th feel like I should be using toner. I don't know why. Look how cute my face looks. I got the salicylic acid booster and I got the vitamin C booster with 10% vitamin C. The salicylic acid one was $8.99, the vitamin C one was $12.99, but guys, if you are a super drug member, you get so much discount. So this originally came to like £33, and then I got everything for £18, just because I have a super drug card. Get one, get one. But yeah, that's everything I wanted to show you for my skincare haul. I also got the Kojic Acid and the sunscreen, so I'll show you guys whenever I do my skincare routine. But I just want to say thank you for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you guys can see the next one. I don't know what it's going to be. Comment down below whatever you want it to be. But you should like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Bye!